Hey guys, welcome back to another video of Westland Survival. How are we doing? Hope you guys are well. So today, what I want to do today is I would like to finish off my wagon. And guess what? I've got everything I need to complete the wagon today. So let's head on over to what we've got so far and what we're missing, of course. So what we're missing is a couple of nails, the wagon axle, a bit of ash board, the steel tools, the reins, the kerosene lamp and a wagon bow so I've been a little busy person over the last couple of days trying to obtain all of the missing pieces to the wagon itself so finally we'll have the ability to up, um, get it completed and hopefully we may be able to do some upgrades as well and we should hopefully be able to take it over to a zone or two or at least to get you guys to have a look at the capacity of it and if we're lucky we might be able to find a safe and we might be able to head back into town and send it over to our um our safe unlocker friend and hopefully we can get some pretty nice neat goodies so that's pretty much what i want to do today with this video and also just to show you guys the wagon itself and also what steps and other upgrade paths that you need to take to get it to um, a state where you guys can use it and it may prove to be um, a worthwhile uh, venture. Now, shout out to the comments to some of you guys in the previous video where I spoke about the oats situation with regards to utilizing the wagon as well. Um, some people do agree with what I was explaining in the last video. So just to recap, at the moment, uh, oats are a little bit hard to come by at the moment. You can get them doing various tasks and activities. Right now, it is sustainable enough for you using your horse on its own, uh, traveling through whatever you need to do, and it is a worthwhile venture utilizing it just for the horse. Now, to say the least, with the wagon at the minute, it isn't, I don't believe. But I will elaborate once we sort of get the, the wagon up and running, and that's pretty much what we're going to do right now. And what I'm gonna find is hopefully I'll find all of my pieces that I'm missing towards the little puzzle that I've got here. So hopefully I've got them here. I'm not too sure if I have them here. I think I actually have them all over here. So let's go ahead and take a look. Ah, here we go. So there's one. What else do I have over here? There's the wagon axle. Very good, good start. Uh, anything here? Yep, and conveniently enough, I had all of the missing pieces here. The only thing I don't have is the ash plank. So we'll head over to the other side over here. And where are you, ash planks? Ah, beautiful. And I think I need one extra. So I'm just going to take both of those for now. And we'll head back over and we'll get our wagon happening. Now, I think there's going to be a situation where we will have to wait a certain amount of time. There's that. There's the final piece. The final piece of the puzzle will be in here. Where are we? you there you are we'll take you come back to you let's finalize now we can travel on a wagon and carry heavy objects look at that that looks awesome so really really loving this as you can see on a neat little platform on its own all that sort of good stuff here we are we've got a upgrade path Wow Okay, 16 hours to upgrade. That's insane. So if I select the upgrade, I will not be able to use that. I don't believe. I am actually a little bit concerned about that. So what I won't do is I won't upgrade it just yet. But if we can ride out of here and we can move on to, let's say, a zone or two 
Now, I don't know what the spawn rates is. To be honest with you, I've been, I have been running the southern zones, well, mainly the ash grove, uh, a little bit. And I suffice to say that since the update video, I haven't actually seen a safe that I can grab. So a little bit concerning with that. But let's have a quick look. As you can see, this requires the the ride now i believe that's all about the oats so if i utilize it i think i'm going to be using oats out of that 69 for the horse 53 for energy and i can walk so i don't know whether or not this will be taken if i take the uh the wagon itself it's a very good question i want to head back into uh home base for a second i just want to armor up real quick and we'll definitely head on out and see what's what. If we're lucky, we may be able to find ourselves um, a few bits and pieces. So we will work that out in a moment. I just want to drop a few things here. I've got some armor in here. Let's have a look. There we go. Let's equip, 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 and equip. That should be enough for today's adventures. And what I wanted to go and grab will be a weapon. Um, let's have a look. Where are we? Okay, that's what I want to grab. I want to equip that in favor of that. Use that as my backup. And I think I've got a weapon or two stashed in my inventory if I should so need it. So that will be that. And in terms of heals and everything else, looks like we're good. I've got a couple of hatchets there. Let's go ahead and craft up a few of those. And, all right. Actually, what I might do is I might go and find myself a pickaxe. See if I've got a pickaxe. I've got a few of these guys, so let's just grab these broken ones and just have those on hand with us just in case. And let's just do that flip that around there we go all right so i've got a few it's not going to last me long um ideally what i'm looking for if i don't find a safe in the ash grove um i'll be able to go to the zone just next to it and i'll hopefully might be able to find a safe or who knows so we go into the maple forest thereafter we'll, we'll see how that how that sort of works out but let's race over i just want to see if the animation changes if i've got the wagon as well that i'm not too sure but what i'm thinking is and i've been thinking about it for a little while now uh ever since the wagon uh, release had it sort of you know came out basically so if i go over here the wagon is in here okay there you go and that was my theory um that i wanted to sort of test out real quick if I had ridden over over here on the horse or whatever, or used up energy to move over here, will that still be here? It obviously isn't. So you, you are required to bring over your um, your wagon in order for you to um, you know utilize it. Obviously, so it's not like a free hit. You can't sort of use it in a sense where. Um, you can sort of sneak away, um, you know, certain, uh, use certain elements. So whether it be your energy, your, your horse, in this case, we're using the wagon in order for us to take ourselves down this way. So look at the, the rate of the oats that are dropping. It's, it is quite considerable in order for us to utilize it. So like I said, right now, is it worth it? I don't know just yet, only because that we haven't found ourselves a, um, a, a safe we haven't opened a safe yet so once I've, i do find that i'll definitely show you guys and if there is there, there you go that, that's that's pretty much how the animation looks as well so you've got your capacity here can you move here and then you've got your capacity here okay cool so it's not like a big grouping or anything like that so the only concern that i have right now is if i utilize the wagon and if i do end up finding a safe somewhere will this be enough um or worth it i should say rather so is it worth it for me to utilize it right now right now i'm saying no until i find a safe 
and see what's inside and see if it is actually worth my time you know spent doing this kind of thing so um, so for the most part what I want to do is I want to try and find as much ash as possible because I am going through it quite considerably and only because that I've been needing it for certain resources and things like that but I do need it um, especially for upgrades so upgrading uh, workstations and things like that that's the next thing that I want to utilize the the ash planks for and hopefully by then um, I'll be able to you know uh, repurpose that into different type of um, upgrading and crafting and things like that a little bit later on so that's where I'm at with things right now now for the life of me I can't even actually remember what the symbol was for the safe so hopefully like I said we'll see it today on camera and if we do then at least we can you know um, see how it all sort of works out but also in saying that the the more that I use the wagon the worse it's going to be especially uh, utilizing oats and things like that now I will use some oats today just to sort of demonstrate everything of course um, everything's for science um, and it's all just for the greater good for you guys to sort of see and sort of experience it yourselves now I'm not too sure how many of you guys have actually gotten yourselves the wagon and are beginning to use it and yeah if you guys are considering to use it how and when should you be using it is probably the biggest question so as I said, I don't want to be a person that is um, uh, negative towards anything because I am um, happy and thankful that the developers have updated this uh, game to a point where we are starting to get some of the long-awaited uh, elements being brought into the game. So Wagon was one of them. Uh, next is, I would probably suspect, would be the fishing uh, side of things. So now that this, this is here, hopefully fishing may not be too far away. Who knows? That's what I'm thinking, but again, I could be wrong. So it all comes down to the development roadmap, what they feel is going to be applicable here. Um, no, no, don't do that. What are you doing? You, you rather you rather go chop wood than rather than taking down the uh, the uh, Piazza here. I get it. I understand. Uh, definitely do not disagree with you there, my friend. Um, because you know, right now. He is doing a bit of work on us right this second. So, was it worth it? Probably not. Oops, no, 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 take all. What are you doing? What are you doing, buddy? All right, I just want you there for the second. Uh, okay, let's go ahead and eat up a few meats there. I just want to sort of get into here a little bit and see, ooh, level up, nice. What I might do is, as soon as I take these guys out, I'm going to drop a point into strength. And only because that I recently updated um, one of my little uh, ornaments for my player, so I can get a little bit of an increase there. I should have been using this for a little bit um, as well, and that, I think that was for the Christmas update, I believe. So, I'm going to put that into damage. And the other reason for that is the, the Lamak gun that I'm using. Um, I can pretty much just about two shot everything in this zone with that gun and the only reason why I need that a little bit of extra strength for things like the Jaguar there um, it's using well sorry I use three shots which I really don't want to use and only because that it leaves about eight bit of health just left behind after you've done the second shot there which is rather annoying for me especially that um, you're using a little bit extra resources that you kind of don't want to use or use up so yeah I figured that um, if I just sort of keep pumping that into that attribute there I will eventually get enough that I can just start two shotting everything and yeah shouldn't have a problem with that moving forward all right so I, oof, here we go what I might do real quick is I know I've got some I know I've got some more stakes there, but I know I've got a few other bits and pieces here, so let's just go ahead and take that, and just hang on to that there, and pop that there, the water can just stay there, I just like having everything where I need it to be kind of thing, so let's just take out this Jaguar, Alpha Wolf, come on, so let's just take you out very quickly, awesome, did you have anything interesting, just a bit of that, um, I'll take your meats, why not? Um, and 
I even look at this as justification as well. The amount of enemies that you see there, is it worth you dealing with and trying to get by them just for a little bit of ash? I don't know. And that's where um, that's where I start, you know, drawing lines and do I sort of want to do that? I have no idea. But anyway, that's where where I sort of think about things and you know how I sort of want to do things when I'm in a zone. But let's just quickly continue on here. I do not see anything. Ooh, hello. Where'd you come from? Come on. Hey buddy. There we go. Time to sleep. And just take what I need from you. Okay, so I don't see any safes here, unfortunately. So, do I, do I have to go here? I have to go here. Because I believe from what I recall is that the wagons stay in the zone that you leave it at. So if you decide to jump ship and take your, your horse, it doesn't go along with you for the ride. That's what my understanding was when I, um, when I read the update notes. I'll have to refer back to it, but if you guys are a little bit more privy to that, let me know in the comments so everyone else can um, be informed as well at the same time. But yeah, that's what I was... That's what I recall when I, when I read the notes, or when I was reading the notes out uh, to you guys. So yeah, anyway. But let's go through here. And in this zone... There's a few other little bits and pieces here. So we've got our cotton that we'd like to, or sorry, linen. What am I saying cotton for? Uh, linen, we've got the, a couple of gangsters here. Not gonna be too much of an issue. Just sort of kill you guys. Nice and easy. Get the little loot there. I know it might, might not be really good loot, but you never know. As you can see there, it was a, a decent find. So not too shabby. But what I'm really hoping to find is hopefully we'll get a safe for ourselves. Like I said, I only was able to find it on the initial update, so I don't know how this all works out. So I'm going to have to do some um, researching on this as well. Now that we have it, I don't know why I aggravated this fella here, but that's fine. Um, for the life of me, I can't even remember what it looked like. I think it was in form of a chest or a safe looking icon I, I, as I said I can't really remember and it's that that's that <laughs> that is frustrating for me just because I know when I see it I'll be happy but then again um, a surprise surprise I don't know who knows but the element of surprise is always good and being surprised especially on camera just shows how genuine genuine I am yeah I don't know that's just me. I think everyone has their own thoughts behind that, so I'll, I'll, I'll leave that up for debate for you guys. So we've got this here inside. Let's see if there's anything good. Okay, beautiful. Bit of steel. Why not? Oh. Okay, and of course you just want to spawn in and raise havoc. Okay, and this raider here, let's just deal with you. Easy enough. Okay, so far I haven't seen anything that's indicating that I've found what I've been looking for, but I wanted to get to the wagon area here anyway, because that's basically where we're going to find it, I think. And I might just go and buy last memory, if that serves me correctly, and I've lost... Uh, there's nothing there. I don't think there is anything there, to be honest with you. I've lost all of my equipment, unfortunately. Okay. Boom. Oop, I don't want to pick up the pine log, but anyway. I want to get this uh, chromite here as well, so as much as I can while I'm in here, I may as well go for it. But right now, I don't see anything that is showing me that I've got... No, here we go. This is not good. Okay, come on, heal up. Oh no, okay, alright. Let's just quickly duck you out for two seconds. Let me equip my other gun and we'll jump back in. Okay, and let's go to backpack. 
boom. Uh, let's use that. Uh, let's get rid of that because I won't need that at all. And what I might do actually is I'll just do that and that. Ah, I don't know what I'm doing here. But just so I've got some um, defense, you know, to some degree, may as well just take these with me. They're there, may as well use them. So let's just go ahead and do that. They're not the greatest in the world, I do understand that, but I just want to be better, safer than sorry, even if it's only just a little bit, as opposed to not having anything at all. So once we head back in, let's check it out. So we went down this way, all well and good. A lot of trees. Ooh. There we go. And you can immediately see the difference as soon as you go back to, say, something like the uh, the Lamart here. It is a very, very powerful weapon. So, yeah, I love this weapon a bit. Um, I think it's one of the best weapons in the game. If not, um, for what you're what you're spending on it, yeah, it's, it's awesome. Okay, so what have we got over here? Oh, of course, he is aggravated by me. There we go. Have you dropped anything decent for me? You have not. But what I might do is I might take all of this because you guys have some pretty decent loot drops now, which is always well and good. But unfortunately, I haven't found what I wanted to find today. And that's the whole point of this video, guys. So, considering that I was able to find it you know, right on the update on the video, which is kind of cliche in a sense, because no one would have it right from the get-go, which is, you know, rather annoying. I find that rather annoying. I'm sure you guys find it rather annoying as well. So it is what it is, but I wouldn't mind having the ability. Oh, that's a nice fur coat. I will take that nice fur coat. Thank you very much. But I haven't found anything here stipulating that I would benefit here by any means of stretch whole bunch of animals here dead person there honestly I just don't think I'm gonna bother these guys over here let me just quickly go over this way oh, what am I doing what am I doing okay let's just crouch 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 okay there is absolutely nothing there of course, this fella just decides to, you know, come down and just say, Hey, look at me. Let me kill you. No, no, you will not. So, yeah, it looks like this has been cleared. Doesn't appear to be anything else here that I can see. Which is rather disappointing. It doesn't look like I've got any eyes on the minimap. I've got my eyes on the minimap and I just don't see anything. So that is rather disappointing. Okay. I'm just going to go up here because I don't think I've been up this way yet. So let's just deal with you. Thank you very much. Um, unfortunately, I do not see anything there either. There is some chroma which I will grab. Because why not? Guess what you could do, and if this is the if this is the case, and if the wagon does, if you are able to leave the wagon behind, I guess you could leave it, you know, in in a um, in an area where you think that that the um, safe may spawn. So, so that that's another theory. Whether or not I would believe that the the map will still reset regardless of the fact. So I've taken it back with me. So what, I, what I'll do purposely is I'll head over to the... Let's say we'll, we'll head over to the bridge. And if it gets left behind, we can always go back. We'll open up the zone right now. See if there's anything there. If we get lucky, we get lucky. But if we zip over to the... Um, 
uh, to the to the bridge, or if we go back to the um, to the maple forest, which you know either either whatever is the more um, economical way of you know coming and going, um, we'll test it out because at least this way you guys can sort of be in the know as well. I'm sure that some of you guys that have already got the wagon have worked that out and are obviously making uh, usability out of it. But what I'm thinking behind this is if that's the case, I, I, I am certain, and I'm just trying to, I'm just trying to go back, just cast my mind back thinking that I'm pretty sure that, that this was the case where if you leave your, your wagon there, you can leave it at a zone. When you're ready to come back and get it, you come back and get it. So I'm thinking that is the way. And that'll probably be the most economical way that you can possibly take your, um, or utilize your wag, uh, your wagon. And if you can utilize it that way, then you're not going to be using a lot of oats in doing so. So I'm guessing that might be the way that this would be, that I would be doing it too, personally. All right, let's just move over this way. Oh, I've got a, a follower. I think this would spawn in a in a certain part of um, in a certain map, and what I mean by that is I recall when I did do this, or sorry, when the update did drop, I was able to. Oh, sorry, I was in a map where there was the cave in this zone. So I'm guessing that particular map of this zone should have what we need or, or what we uh, would require. That's what I'm thinking. But then again, I could be wrong. I could be severely wrong. I'm not too sure. So they, these are the things that I think about. And I, I guess that you got, whether you guys do think about these sort of things as well. I'm assuming that you do. Um, so, but let me know your thoughts in the comments. So how do you think, or how would you know that if you're going to be guaranteed a drop of a safe? Let me know. Yeah, see, there's nothing there. Even if I just sort of bust my way through in here. Oop. And I just want to quickly pick up and see what we've got here. Okay, I'm just going to grab that. I'm just going to head down here. So that's where we came in. Of course, on the way, on the way back in. Anyway, so let's head on up. I haven't explored this part here, so we, we, we won't know until we check this place out, or this part. Come on. Okay, um, let's see, anything over here? I'll grab the ash while I'm sort of, you know, plodding along. There we go. Um, okay. Doesn't appear to be anything here, so... Very good. I'm just gonna make my way around up here. Is there anything up here? Oop. Wasn't really paying attention to the minimap. Unfortunately, there isn't. Okay. So that's pretty much it for these zones. I guess you're gonna have to be very lucky to get a drop. Because right now, there's absolutely no drop here. But what I want to do, um, just to sort of uh, round off the video today, see if the wagon is left where it is. Uh, that takes 20 energy, that takes 23. What do I have? 22, so that's going to do it. Okay, well, there you go. Cool. So the wagon basically sits there. And you're not going to be able to move it until you actually utilize the, the wagon function. So that makes that makes a lot of sense. But this would also serve as a good purpose where now that I've left it in the ash grove, everything is not reset. Okay, well there you go. So that's weird. Usually when you go back and forth like that, your zones do reset in this case it hasn't so i guess that's a really really good well i wouldn't say lesson but i would say it is a very good um indication to well how you guys are going to be utilizing 
the wagon or the way that you might want to shoot or that you could be or should be utilizing uh, the wagon itself. Oops. Come on. All right. And yeah, so even if you leave it here, it's still not going to change the fact. Oop. Now I'm just aggravating anybody and everybody. But as you guys can see here, there is absolutely nothing here that insinuates that we have. There's no, that's just, a, I would say that's a dead body there. Let's just kill you. And I broke my Lamar, so I'm out. <laughs> that's all well and good. Okay, so what I'm thinking is that I would probably suggest for now, uh, well, you know, without testing the theory, of course, is taking the wagon to say somewhere like here. Obviously, it's going to reset. Yeah, it's going to be a little bit for me to ride back, so I won't be able to do just that, unfortunately. But if we end up doing that, I would suspect that if we come back here as per usual, this should reset. But then again, if it does reset and you don't have your wagon there, you won't get the safe because the zone will effectively reset. So that's a, that's a theory. I guess what you could do is you can just leave it here for the most part, okay? And when you're ready or if you feel that you've got enough oats behind you, you can just ferry it across to here and here, I would imagine. If there's any other zones that you guys have been able to find a safe, well, let us know in the comments. But for now, this is the theory that I'm working on with at the moment. So I'm thinking it's these two zones for the most part that you should be able to get a safe spawning in. And that way you can poss uh, possibly leave it here for the moment. And then this way you can actually uh, pick it up from here and um, go back to town and drop it off in town. So that's my theory behind that. But anyway, I think we've deep dive this um, enough. So I want to know your thoughts. I want to know what you guys are thinking. If there's any up uh, anything that I've left out, please drop them in the comments comments there not for my benefit but for everyone else's at the same time and your expertise if you guys are actively using the wagon and have you guys ha had any success please drop them in the comments because i would love to hear and see what you guys have done so far anyway that will go ahead and leave it for today so i appreciate you guys stopping by as always please hit the like button share if you can and if you guys are new to the channel seeing what you like consider subscribing and hitting that notification bell icon so you don't miss out on any future videos. Anyway guys, I'm out of here and as always, I will see you next time.